Hey everybody, welcome to the next part too. Let's play the Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. And this let's play is brought to you by Most Games Not Seen. It's also being played on the Nintendo Wii U. Anyway, uh, we're here at the statue. The mirror shield is what we need to use. And there we go. And now we're going to need our long shot. And of course, keep the mirror shield equipped because for the boss fight, you are definitely going to need the mirror shield. There's actually two boss fights. Oh look, it's the two witches. Well, you know, I like to call it the two bitches. No, it's just like the two witches. It could be in Day, and I like these two. These are like some of my favorite villains. Actually, no, probably my favorite boss in this game. Besides, you know, the boss of Again and again, and I mean, like, table bosses? Out of all the table bosses, these two are my favorite. Mainly because of the dialect they get on with. I don't know what I'm So it looks like we had to face, like, another iron knuckle. <laughs> By the way, Kubi and Kote, one is ice elemental, the other one's fire elemental. But for now, we're not going to worry about that. We have to take out another iron knuckle, and there's something strange about this iron knuckle. Something strange. Um, for the sake of this, I might take damage, I might even die. Uh, this is kind of pretty aggressive, but... Um, also, we can close the doors, and close the locks. But, using the big round sword... Sorry about that, go to my uh, capture card. <laughs> yeah, so uh, I've been doing a lot of recording on this game. Because I'm trying to get this game done, it's been going on for a while. And, uh. Okay, he is going to kill me. Now. <laughs> Luckily for me, I have hackers. Okay, I might be better off just come back with me. Really? Got him. Okay. What the hell? Oh, it's an above. I knew there was something strange about that iron knuckle. Looks like she was being mind controlled or brainwashed. Oh well, it looks like she's back on Kone. Okay, so Kome is the red one and Kote is the um, kind of bluish one. So Kome is ice elemental and Kote is fire. Should we be talking about elementals because we're not playing well next week? But you know. Anyway, I don't believe I can leave this area and go back and get any fairies or anything like that. So, luckily for me, I don't think I can. Nope, apparently I can. Shit. Well, the good thing is all I need is my sword and the mirror shield. So let's go for the store and get ready for the boss. The true boss of this temple. Like I said, the iron knuckle, which was actually, you know, the rule is not the final boss of this area. The final boss is up here. And we already know who it is. It's the witches. But. It's an interesting boss. It's not a hard boss, but it's a very interesting boss, in my opinion. <laughs> so 
boss fight, I'll put it here to the bone. And with my frost, I will freeze him to his soul. That's a cool one. Alright, so. It's time to take on. The Sorceress Sister in the world. This fight has two phases. What you want to do. Phase number one. And it's completely random. It's one of the sisters will use an elemental on you. You have to basically aim it at the other sister. So, she uses ice, I aim it at the fire one, and she uses fire, I'll aim it at the ice. <laughs> Oh, I just missed. And it's random, so sometimes we get three rounds of ice, we get one and then two rounds of fire. It's completely random. Oh, What? Like, really? You actually hit me? Once you hit, I think, one sister a few times in a row, like three times in a row or something, you don't even hit the damage to sister, you don't get the phase too. Okay, so nice. Okay. Little sister wasn't there so... The camera angles can be bad on this platform, but... Luckily for me, I have another fairy, so... <laughs> that was perfectly timed. Okay, so, time for things here. And now, they're going to merge. Don't want Dynamite attack. And that's the one. And she wouldn't say it. Oh, baby, baby. This phase is a little bit different. Basically, so you fire or ice on you, you have to block it with the shield. So what you'll do is your see your shield is flashing. Your absorber at the three shots of the same elemental. So fire in this case. They will trick you sometimes. The shield will be able to fire a blast. There you go. Now you have to go over and attack them with your sword. You can use the big round sword if you want to, but I'm just gonna use the magic sword because they swap swords. Uh, sometimes they won't try to trick you, so they might use, in this case, ice. Second attack, baby fire. Just saying. Ice again. Okay, so we need a third ice. Sadly, with that camera angle, I could not see what they were doing. Fuck, that's fun. Now I see them. Perfect. And they use ice. Nope. Fire. Ah. As soon as they might use ice, fire, fire, like ice, ice, fire. If you have your shield targeting you, walking you with fire, and then you absorb the ice, it cancels it out, and then you gotta start over again. So keep that in mind. So, right now, let's do this again. Alright, perfect. If she uses fire, the best thing to do is to dodge. Oh, okay, no, nice again. 
So far, we are doing really well. Of course, if I use jump attacks or even the thing on sword, I probably have to update that to be it. So I had to use a big round sword the last time I attacked her, I probably would have killed her. Alright, and there we go. Twin Rover is defeated. So the last stage will be unlocked. Now this is why I like these two, because they are so fun. Look, they got halos on their heads. Hey, Chloe. What is that above your head? I don't know, but you have one over your head too, it's okay. I call Halo, you guys are dead. But I'm only 400 years old. And I'm just three. How the hell are you th <laughs> See, this is what I like about these two, they argue. How can you be older? <laughs> They're dead. I'll come back to haunt you. I like how to say I'll, but it shouldn't be like will come back to haunt you. And I almost died. <laughs> but luckily, I had another fairy if I needed. So this is our final heart container. We are now at 20 hearts, which is the maximum in this game. So, that's it. Basically, all I have to do now is get a arrow upgrade. Which I'll do in a good training grounds. A bomb upgrade. I don't even really need the bomb upgrade. I'll probably get it anyway. And then it's basically Ganon's castle for the finish that. So we are very close to ending this game. Very close. And I already know what my next project's going to be, but I'm not going to announce it right now. I'll announce that in the finale video of this LP, which is. Not that far off, to be honest. It's probably closer than you think. Uh, I'm kind of like delaying re uh, uploading Final Fantasy X. I still haven't done any grinding in that in terms of the uh, cheer with the Storm of Faith. <laughs> so I'm trying to I'm pushing this game out a lot because I want to get this one finished. So. The probably all witches. Those witches. Yeah, they're dead, so I don't think you really have to worry about that. I'll give you this medallion. We had a promise was we had to give her the silver gauntlets or something like that. Now we don't have to worry about doing that. We get to keep them. And we get the medallion. Which is great. So then we should be able to go back to the Desert Colossus and then I'll meet you at the Temple of Time. Uh, in the next video basically. So. But yeah. Ah, so what is this? Princess Vuto likes us, and the Vuto likes us, and we don't know what really about Zelda things, but I'm assuming Zelda likes us. So, you know, make some womanizer. Maybe that's how I'm putting your spirits wrong, how womanizer is actually about Link. Uh, yes, the hero. Succeeded. Yeah, but we still don't know what happened to Zelda. Now, seven years later, we don't know what happened to Zelda. And who is this chic anyway? 